And then on this Wellness Wednesday, we take you once again to the YMCA for a little switch up to weightlifting. That's right. Rather than the usual dumbbells, a nice way to change up your style is kettlebells. Take a look. All right, so we are here at the YMCA learning about some alternative routines to your workout. So today we're going to learn all about the kettlebells, and that's why we have Matt here to show us some moves. That's right. Yes. So today we're going to be learning the kettlebell swing. Okay. Oh, Ooh, is that like a dance? Like a swing <laughs> dance, a kettlebell swing? Not like, exactly. I wouldn't want to dance. Maybe I can turn dance, it into a dance. Although it is a cardio activity. So the kettlebell okay. swings. Okay. So okay. This is a great strength exercise. It's good for conditioning. It's good for cardiovascular health. Okay. Sounds like a good so one. So let's get into the form. Okay. All right. Hold the kettlebell loosely, both hands. Okay. You want your feet to be outward, uh, slightly outward angle. Like a penguin? And about hip width apart. <laughs> Not penguin. Quite like a penguin. A little less than that. <laughs> so we're going to squat down. Okay. You want your, the crease of your yeah. hips to go just a little bit below your knees. Down. All right. You're going to put your weight on your heels. Wait. And you're going to use your heels to drive your glutes and quads. I'm already getting sore just standing there. <laughs> <laughs> I know. All right, let's skip the motion. It's, it's actually pretty simple. Okay. So you're using the momentum of the kettlebell to drive this movement. Okay, I'm going to watch you. Okay. We're going to get a nice swing going. And honestly, the piece of equipment, the kettlebell itself, is doing most of the work. Me too. But if you're an overachiever, there's more. <laughs> Another classic movement with the kettlebell is the goblet squat. Okay. You're going to take the kettlebell and hold it both hands. Okay. Kind of a similar position to the kettlebell swing. You want your feet to be slightly elbowly angled. Okay. Split apart. Squat down. Again, you want the crease of your hips to go below your knees if you can. Okay. You're going to hold the weight about oh my. face high. So it's kind of like that looks like a workout in itself. That, that looks mustache. dangerous. And just going to go up and down. Oh, okay. Nice, simple squat. So I'm going to do mine kind of modified. I can't go down that low. <laughs> this is great for the glutes. Yeah. No, it's pretty simple. It's a workout though, huh? Oh, you for feeling sure. It? Totally. Yeah. It's awesome. Get down here and try the kettlebells. Lewis, kettlebells, they're not easy. No, they're, they're not. They're slightly tough. You'd think they would be easy because they just like look they like They look this. like these cute little Yeah, they look purses. like a little purse. You can like carry it around in a purse, but they of are not a purse. Weight. Purse, Purse of, of death. Dead weight. Purse of death is what I call it. <laughs> good workout though. It is a good workout. I mean, workout. really, when we were just standing there holding them, I was, I was. Getting, yeah, I mean, if you I just wanted to squat far. down and hold it, you wouldn't even need to go back up and down. But if you wanted to try it out and you don't really know, you know, you don't know what you're doing, ask anyone down there because they uh, yeah, the know exactly staff what is doing. great. Yeah, the staff, and they'll get you. They'll point you in the right direction.